Though the concept of sutureless aortic wall replacement was introduced several decades back, it was redeveloped one decade back based on experience with transcatheter aortic wall replacement. Initial randomized control trial used a standard balloon expandable wall with three guiding sutures and deployed through a minimally invasive upper hemisternotomy. Once the wall was properly seated, a 10 second balloon inflation was given and the guiding sutures were tied followed by closure of iototomy. They demonstrated significantly reduced myocardial ischemic time and better wall hemodynamic function than full sternotomy surgical aortic wall replacement with a conventional standard bioprosthesis. Currently two types of walls are available. One has a self-expandable nitinol frame while the other one has balloon expandable stainless steel cloth covered frame. A recent review of the topic gives us a lot of insights on the option of sutureless surgical aortic wall replacement. Some studies have reported lower transvalar gradients and lower incidence of mild aortic regurgitation, lower cross clamp time and cardiopulmonary bypass times with sutureless walls. Shorter lengths of hospital stay were also documented. There was no difference in one-year mortality between sutureless and conventional wall replacements. Paravalla leaks were equivalent or higher with sutureless AVR compared to conventional surgical AVR, but lower than transcatheter aortic wall replacement. Paravalla leak was also associated with operator experience and is expected to decrease in future. Stroke rates were similar between sutureless and conventional surgical AVR. Compared to transcatheter aortic wall replacement, it was equivalent or lower. Rate of permanent pacemaker was higher after sutureless AVR compared to conventional surgical AVR, but lower compared to transcatheter aortic wall replacement.